Three years ago, the tides of revolution, mysteries and masks washed the nanofish dippers up on the shores of Boomtown. A scrappy band of fish-human hybrids from Berlin's underbelly. Spreading their offbeat melange of reggae and ska on Berlin's squats, reclaim raves, protest camps and clubs large and small, the nanofish dippers crossed paths with local legends such as the Magic Touch and the Italian resistance heroes of the Medina City Ramblers. They toured Russia from Moscow to the Black Sea and played a bunch of festivals, not all of which were later sued by retired police officers. 2014 saw the release of their first record, Fish Eat Fish. I have often told you that I am that little fish who swims under a shark and I believe lives indelicately on its awful. Anyway, that is the way I am. Life moves over me in a vast black shadow and I swallow whatever it drops with relish. Having learned in a very hard school that one cannot be both a parasite and enjoy self-nourishment. Without moving in roads too fantastic, even my disordered imagination to people with meaning. The band works like a swarm of tiny fish, always in flux due to the individual musicians travelling and returning to Berlin. As if the Nanofish Dipper's original roots reggae and ska style hadn't been strange enough to begin with, their sound continuously evolves and changes with the new musical influences brought back home to Berlin from South Italy, Barcelona and Korea, London and Mexico, California and Japan, La Reunion and Vietnam, inspired by funk and hip-hop, swing and Latin, punk and dub. Whatever sinister scheme it was that first drew the Nanofish Dippers to Boomtown, now they are returning. Is it to harvest the fruit of seeds planted those years ago? Is it to finish a mission still unconcluded? Or to settle an old score? Put on your fish masks, fill your mouth with water, checkmate the fate.